Breaking news from Onondaga Lake Parkway where a coach bus trying to turn around on the road this evening was hit by a car. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jeff Kulikowski. I'm Christy Casciano, and this time it looks like a bus driver saw signs for the low bridge, but when turning around without police help, caused a different kind of crash. News Channel 9's Ashley Cafaro live along the parkway for us tonight. Ashley, what happened? Yeah, Jeff and Christy, Liverpool police say a call came in just after 8.30 tonight about an accident involving a car and bus. That resulted in the Onondaga Lake Parkway shutting down both lanes and both directions for about an hour. Now, we're told by 911 dispatchers that the bus was trying to turn around on the parkway when it was hit by a car. The driver of the car suffered a minor injury. I'm told Onondaga Park Police were the first ones to arrive on scene and are handling this case. It took crews a little over an hour to get the car on a wrecker and taken away and for the bus to leave the scene. Now, even though the bus did not hit the bridge. The state DOT recently told uh, News Channel 9 that drivers will see more signs and enhanced signs in addition to the 45 signs that are already posted on both sides of the bridge. Make sure, to make sure you stick with us on air and online as we continue to follow this developing story. Live in the town of Salina, Ashley Caparo, News Channel 9. All right, as you can see behind Ashley, all clear now no lanes blocked anymore and as ashley said if you want to continue to follow the story check back to localesquire.com and be sure to watch the morning news beginning at 4 30.